Holy smokes, guys, look at that. Look on top. What does it say? The new era of Call of Duty is coming. Stay frosty for the worldwide reveal of Modern Warfare number dose number two. We'll say the, the best thing of all of this right now is the fact that at the end of that little said trailer or whatnot, the intro, the outro, whatever, yeah. It shows, uh, it, they, they play the freaking old school Modern Warfare 2 sound effect. So, I I personally think that's really sick and awesome, and I love it. But guys, just to give you guys a quick, quick update. Yes, Operation Monarch is over. Sad face, super sad face. I enjoyed the mode. Did you guys enjoy it? I hope you guys did. But, there's now, you know, we're, we're back at it and back to normal. And there's been a lot of different updates, uh, according to, you know, obviously Vanguard and also uh, Warzone. So here we got uh, Caldera Resurgence Quads, so that they, they brought Resurgence back, but instead of Caldera now, just like we were Resurgence, right? There you go. It's Caldera Resurgence. Or we got Caldera Clash, which is Team, DM, team Deathmatch, which is 50 versus 50. I believe they're testing out right now uh, 120 players, you know? Uh, unlike the usual 100, it's 120 players now. But then you also got regular Battle Royale. If you want to go at the regular play pace, not the resurgence type of mode. There's that too. There's solos, duos, trios, and quads. So there you go. Those are the new stuff right now. Uh, but there's also, uh, I guess, there's new stuff in Vanguard that we'll check out. I mean, this, other stuff. Ooh, the Mecha Godzilla, Godzilla stuff is all here still. Uh, so we're going to go to Vanguard and check it out. But in Warzone, they also changed stuff with the stem updates, all the little patch update notes. I'll link it down below in the description. But uh, another thing, one last thing I can tell you is that. Uh, you know, you, how much armor you have, how much, like, what's your attachment, how much money, all that stuff. I mean, that's what it was there before, but on the bottom left screen, when you would spawn in, you'll actually be able to see that stuff, like what equipment you got, uh, how many plates you got. So if you, get, you got, like, five, people will be like, oh, do you have any plates? I need some plates. I'm like, oh, I don't have any. Nope. I mean, it says you have five. What are you talking about? So, yeah, there's that now. That's, that's what probably most likely happen. And uh, yeah, so let's just go straight to Vanguard and see what the new other stuff is. Guys, I forgot one. Of, I, guess, I guess I forgot one of the biggest things ever. But guys, another thing that they added is an underground train transit system. Okay, and it's a, it, this is classified arms reloaded. Okay, but yes, arsenal, docks, runway, beachhead, peak, fields, airfield, power plant, capital, resort, lagoon, ruins, all of it. You can go from a point, you know. All over the place you can transit kind of like with uh verdansk back in verdansk right uh you can go to the train system below you know and here it's a mine system um so it's like it's all mines so it's down below of the map and you can go there and take it from place to point a to point b c d a you know all of them so so there you go i forgot to mention that guys real quick but uh, we're in call of duty vanguard now and uh, yes, there's a new map, guys. It's called Sphere, okay? I don't know if it's a remake or whatever, but Sphere is here. And uh, there's also new guns that we got going on, which is great. We got updates. There's zombie updates, too. Very minimal zombie updates, though. Like, nah, there's no, like, ground-based map yet. I believe at the end of this season, that's when we're going to get zombie um, ground-based map. Ground-based mode, I suppose. You could say because uh, I believe it's gonna be Shino Numa, like the full map. Shino Numa and full, like actual full legit rounds, you know. I don't know, but guys, for right now we got Sh Sphere 24/7 for the players update. Ship House 24/7, Small Zone Blitz, Western Front, Arms Race, Champion Hill Duos, and that's about it for now, guys. There's new new stuff here, and that's the one we saw in Warzone, which is the job well done pack which is the new i believe this is a submachine gun i mean this looks weird i mean this looks something from i don't know is it bad to say maybe advanced warfare i don't know pretty uh kind of futuristic kind of kind of but um but it's okay uh but we also okay here it is so it's the h4 blixen Favored by Special Ops Forces, this hard-hitting SMG offers mobility and accuracy in the medium-range engagements. There we go. So, yeah. So, it's for the new gun. For that new gun that we just saw, in, or like the bundle right we, that we just saw, it's for that one. See? There we go. See? It's for that one. So, uh, but uh, there we go. That's kind of kind of interesting. It's, a, it's different. It's, um, I don't know if it's a remake or just a re, you know, rename of a different gun that we know or we've seen before. I mean, maybe from Call of Duty World War II. I don't know. If you guys know, let me know. But 
Uh, it looks pretty cool, but the only way, the way the way to uh, unlock is get three slight kills in a single match. That's pretty easy. I would highly suggest if you guys want to go for the challenge, uh, go for multiplayer or sorry multiplayer hardcore hardcore mode. That's what you gotta go, and you can play either the new map or just the um, I guess ship hot. Just slide around, slide, just you know, spend, hit fire, whatever. You'll you'll get the kills. <clears throat> A lot of uh, just additions and changes like to war zone, and there's also stuff to here with Vanguard. Also for zombies. They be I believe that they changed one of the like that bad guy, uh, that enemy from that new map. They changed her uh, when she changed her changes switches her mask. You can kind of shoot her or hurt her more now, but with the cost of her special attack or a special lightning attack, uh, hurting us more, hurting the player more. So eh, that's pretty much it for the zombie side, I think. But um, other than that, that's, that's you know that's that's all the big changes I could tell you right now. Another change is the perk system or the perks that they moved around a couple perks. I believe they moved overkill. It used to be in the in the intel or supply side, I believe, but now it's on the tactics. Oh, sorry, yeah, tactics side. So there we go. Um, but they also mess with some of the perks, you know, here and so forth. But yeah, that's pretty much it. I wanted to tell you guys, you know, the, the update for the point five update or like you know whatever you know combined arms. Out of nowhere, they just changed. They just got new updates going for Warzone, for Vanguard, and more stuff coming in after that. Um, I'm hoping at the end of it, we'll get more news on the round base map changes or additions. You know, that's it. If you guys enjoyed, press like my guys. Also, in the description is the patch notes, but it's also a link to my Twitch. Follow me, guys, for a nice stream. Again, that's it, guys. Take care, stay amazing, and I'll see y'all with the next video.